Buai. Hello, viewers, and welcome to Emeka Williams Spiritual Tips. I am your brother, Pastor Emeka Williams. And today, I am going to be talking on a very powerful, God-blessed plant or herb called mint. M-I-N-T, mint. I'm going to be talking about how you can use this plant, this mint, connecting to each spiritual energy to bring about healing, bring about prosperity, and bring in about wealth. So if you are ready, let's go. Now, before I continue with these particular teachings on these spiritual tips, on how to use mint, bring about spiritual healing, bring about physical healing, and open an environment and atmosphere for reception of prosperity, wealth, and abundance. If this is your first time of coming in contact with this face, don't forget I mentioned my name earlier on, Pastor Emeka Williams. Welcome to our channel. It's a spiritual channel where we learn on spirituality by using natural materials, herbs, plants, and all kinds of natural things to solve our problems, to manifest good things and live a fulfilling life by using or connecting to their spiritual energies, properties, vibrations, and frequencies. So, you have to become a bona fide member of this particular family by kindly subscribing to our channel. As you do so, may the good God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob bless you endlessly in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Now to my returning subscribers, my returning viewers, old and new, I say double thumbs up to you, my backups. My fans, you are the best fans in the world. And I will not take your love for me for granted. I just want to say thank you. Every one of you that has been a part to the growth of this America Williams Spiritual Tips family. I say may the good God who seared in secret and rewarded openly, reward you all openly with abundance of blessings that you will not have enough room to accommodate in the mighty name of of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Then to the owner of all glory, because it is a normal saying that give honor to whom honor is due. To the God who created all things and is not created by anything, the uncreated creator, the maker of heaven and earth, the almighty God whose name is I am that I am, who has given you life and given me life who has protected and provided for us. May all glory, honor, and adoration be unto your holy name, O God, as I bow my head in gratitude and in acknowledgement for everything you have done for us in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Now, talking about the herb, the plant, mint, it has several health benefits as much as spiritual benefits. The mint is an edible plant. But in this video, I am only going to focus on how you can use it in your spiritual works to manifest abundance, to manifest blessings. The mint has the property and the ability to repel negativity and draw good things in. The mint plant. You want to heal yourself spiritually. How do you use mint for spiritual healing? Maybe your spiritual life is going down and down. You used to pray very well before and you can no longer pray. You used to be a firebrand before and now you find out that everything is going down. The fire is going down. As a result of uh, the uh, um, arrows Attacks and all manner of invasion that has invaded your spirit man spiritually and you have sustained some spiritual injuries 
which are not visible to the eyes. Mint is a medicine for that. How do you heal yourself, your inner man, using mint? What do you do? Boil mint and make a tea of it. After you have boiled it to become a tea, pour the tea in a glass cup. Now pray to God that you are using this mint tea as a healing medication to whatsoever spiritual illness that you are passing through. Say your intention into that cup of mint tea. Then drink it with faith. You will see how your spirit man will be rejuvenated. Your spiritual life, your spiritual gift will be boosted back. There will be healing by the reason of the power of healing that God has bequeathed to the mint leaf. Another way you can use the mint leaf, because there has been several teachings on how you can draw money, draw attraction of wealth into your hand using cinnamon, using bay leaf. But mint is the one of the best amongst them all. How do you use mint to draw money into your wallet? Get few leaves of mint. Get a note, a currency note. You can decide to get three leaves of the mint. Cut them. Pray. Command the energy of attraction of money and riches in mint to draw money into your pocket. To draw riches and wealth into your pocket, into your wallet, into your account. Then you roll the money over the mint. You put the mint inside the currency note and fold it together. Then you insert it into your wallet. Another way you can use it to draw success into your business. Get some leaves of mint. Put it in your drawer. Where you put your money drawer. Where you put your money. As you are selling, as you are making money, you are putting the money there. You speak to the leaf what you want it to do in that drawer. To attract success to that particular business you are doing. This can also be used when you are seeking for promotion. It could also be used for drawing of promotion. The mint leaf. Now you can equally use this mint in the candle magic. How do you use this mint with a candle when you want to draw money? You want to attract love. You want to do any candle work that is for bringing in good things. Get some chunk of mint leaf like this. Then get a base oil like Goya olive oil or jojoba oil or you can even get extra virgin oil. Then pour some amount of that oil in a frying pan or a small pot. Drop the mint leaf inside the oil and let it boil together. You that you're asking, how can I get prosperity oil? How can I get favor oil? How can I get uh, 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 abundance oil? Oil to increase. This is the method how you can get that oil. Let the energy of the mint boil and mix with that oil. You can allow it to boil for like 30 minutes so that it would have mixed. The energy has entered and penetrated inside the oil. Then when that is done, you've gotten your oil, your mint oil. You get your candle. If you want to do money works, green candle is the best. Prosperity work, green candle. You could also use yellow candle or, uh, or golden candle. You are not the color type of person. You can use white colored candle to do whatever you want to do. As long as candle works and candle magic is concerned. 
You want to do love work, romantic love work, the red candle is the best. You know, platonic love, you can use the pink. Healings, you can use the blue color. So you know what you want to attract with the mint, with the candle work, as long as it's success, abundance, prosperity, or you want to clear off negative energies from you, you can use that mint oil and a black candle together to clear off negative energies. Now, another way you can use this mint as a plant to repel evil spirits around you and to open up to attract good things, you just go and get yourself a flower vase and plant mint and keep it around your domain. This is how far I will go today on this wonder plant, the mint. Go and try it out. You are going to see that God uses all these natural things to bless people. Look at it. I have some amount of it here that I'm equally going to use for myself. Apart from this, this one that I brought out for the teaching purposes, I have more here that I want to use. Because as much as I am preaching prosperity to you, what you can do to live a better life, I also want to live a better life. Everyone wants something good. Now, don't forget to like my video, share my videos, subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already, and do not hesitate to give me a WhatsApp call or a WhatsApp chat. Write your comments at the comment section down below. I am open for communication. But adventure, you want me to do anything for you. You want me to help you in anything spiritual. Call me, chat me, let's discuss and dialogue on how I will come in to help you. But do not forget, nothing is free, even in free time. God bless you. It is only salvation that is free. Thank you. Till we meet again in my next video. I love you guys.